Good morning guys, welcome to my very tired uh, start to the vlog. Today is moving day at last. I feel like I've been anticipating this day for so long. I am excited. My movers are supposed to come in the next like hour. I basically have everything as packed up as it pretty much can be pre-movers. So I have most of my stuff in boxes, but um, my furniture isn't like wrapped up and I have just like a ton of boxes and I have a bunch of bags too, like trash bags and stuff. I feel like you envision moving as this process where you just like all of these like these 10 perfectly sized like moving boxes and you just put them on a truck and go. But moving is, oh my God, it is so much just like so much stuff. I don't understand how I have so many things in just this apartment. So I'll give you guys a quick little overview of what like my space looks like now. It is so white, ugly, empty. Basically, this is it. Everything is off the walls and everything's in boxes that can be in boxes. However, I don't have any left. So I have a lot of stuff that the movers are just gonna like probably, you know, wrap and move themselves but I have a ton of boxes of stuff for my new place over here. All of this will be gone soon. I took off my bedding, they're gonna take that apart. My closet is not actually that empty. I'll have all of my clothes because they're bringing wardrobe boxes, which is really, really great for moving clothes because you just take the clothes, basically it's a box that has a bar and you just take the clothes and like transfer them to the box and then you can put them easily in your new space. Thank God because taking all of these off of hangers and putting them all back on would not be my ideal situation. Situation. So we got that and then basically out here is craziness. It is just like So messy look at all of this stuff This is all stuff that I'm moving pretty much besides the couch and the corner stuff Megan started packing up that stuff But like all the rest of this the kitchen's a disaster because Megan's also just started packing yesterday So everything is just crazy. I'm gonna have to tell the movers like don't take like these certain things only take like this stuff because I don't want our stuff to get all like mixed up and everything but yeah um, hopefully it'll be a smooth move I'm gonna charge this camera because the battery is dying um, but I will see you guys in a little bit I'm excited to take you guys along hopefully the next time I talk to you I'll be a little more awake I feel like I'm gonna pass out right now I'm so tired I need coffee Squirtle, it's officially happening. We are leaving. This is what is left of the living room. Things that Meg is taking. This is what's left of this area. Oh, it looks horrible in here. Our carpets are disgusting. I'm left. She's left. My room is echoing. You guys, it looks so weird when there's nothing in here, like obviously, but this is taking me back. It's taking me back when we moved in, baby. Had a lot of memories in this place. My last walk-in closet, I don't have a walk-in closet at my new apartment, which is really depressing. That was the one thing that I was... <sighs> oh, hey, a hanger. Nice. Goodbye, closet. Goodbye room. Wave goodbye with my hanger. It was a beautiful stay. All right. Be out of this bit. Can I have Say bye to the vlog. Bye vlog. It's been a great run. It's been an incredible run. Um, do you want to tell my vlog in case they don't know your moving situation? Because yes, we get just all these crazy questions, we man. We really get crazy questions. I'm moving on Sunday as well, and I'm going to be like 15 minutes from home. Yeah. So, yeah. so Megan's going to see Squirtle whenever she wants. They're going to hang out all the time, babysit. It's going to be great. We're so excited both about our new places, and it's... It's just a great, it, this is a monumental, this is the longest place that I lived besides my house in Georgia, so. I'm gonna monumental, miss it. Um, this was a, a monumental move. Yeah. You're crazy, are you ready to go to our new apartment? He's like, 
Man, I don't even know what you're talking about anymore. He's like, I wouldn't stay with the whole ass. Let's go. He's gonna miss this thing. <laughs> oh my word, at last. Me and Squirtle have made it to my new apartment and I haven't shown you guys it yet. So there is a few things that the movers have already moved in, but most of my stuff isn't in here yet. So I can show you most of the empty space. I'm so happy, I'm so excited. Ah, okay, so let's start with. Whoa, hi sir. All right, so you come in and then basically the kitchen is all along one wall and it's just kind of like a long, this is me, I'm a kitchen. I love how like sleek the stainless steel appliances look. I love the fridge, ah, I love it. I have hardwood floors all through the space. It's basically just all one open space. So I'm gonna have like my bedroom area over here. You know, the rest will be in this area. So we'll see, it's gonna take me so long to do this place. But um, my one of my favorite things about this loft is, oh, you can't really tell, let's go up close. There you go, the brick walls that are all along this way. Ah, this is my view of downtown. This is my crap. <laughs> and then you just continue. There's this cool wall, which is sweet, which I, this is my closet. You're like, what? It's, um, as I said, it's not a walk-in. However, it is pretty long, um, but you know, I'm probably gonna need a little bit more closet space. So I'm probably gonna do something, something on this wall, but then again, I might put my bed. My bed's gonna go somewhere over here, so I don't know. It's gonna take just a while, basically. There is also another closet right here, which is amazing, and I will definitely be using this for, to store, you know, whatever can fit in here, basically. Hello, I'm actually filming right now. <laughs> and then we have my washer and dryer over here and lastly we have my bathroom which i love it's so pretty i love the kind of windowy door i love the sh i have a shower a separate shower and a really nice bath and then i have two sinks and this is my favorite part honestly the storage there is so much more storage in this bathroom than there was in my last bathroom I love it, I'm so excited. Squirtle's excited, he's sniffing around the area. And that is my apartment, so I'm gonna let my movers finish up and help them out, and we are here, woo! So, my men are over. Ollie and Dylan are here, they're my first guests! And um, I wanna show you guys, because it looks different than when you saw it before, um, there's not, really any lighting in here besides like right what i guess when you walk in maybe there is no there's really not so i need to get some i have my lamps but it's pretty dark like, it's pretty um, dark like in here right now light strips. yeah like an led light strips everything's just basically it's like my old apartment like threw up in this apartment but like a little bit like different <laughs> bunch of boxes to be unpacked over here just like everything is stressing me out because it's a disaster. I can't wait to show you guys when it's actually like coming together because this is not going here, this dresser ain't going there. None of this stuff is going to be here. I don't know if I'm going to keep this futon because the zipper busted on it and I can't get a new just cushion. So I don't know what I'm going to do about that. I got a rug, this is from Ikea, but I don't, I, I don't know if I'm going to keep it. I don't know, I don't know. We're going to go get coffee though, so let's do it. Let's do it. Guys, this coffee shop just completed me. Like, I drank my whole coffee before I could vlog it for you guys. Do you have any left? No. Barely. No, you have a little bit I more. I have a lot left because I'm not drinking it. Dylan, this is Oh, look at this. We are passionate. We have Can been I passionately talking about. This is, this yeah, please tell See, look at this coffee. It has like a throth. They, yeah, they, they must whip take it. like Phil's coffee. Oh. Out I think they take like a throther. I just, is that the word? Is that how you say it? <laughs> I don't know. And they just like whisk it because look at that foam. It's so creamy and look and guys, we they just They put want... the milk in it for you. 
Mm. They're so nice too. That was amazing. They were so nice to us. Apparently this place just opened, but I think they have other locations, but I'm not sure if it's just in, okay, I'm not sure if it's just in California in though. That's really popular. I'll be going this weekend, honestly. I'm taking Megan. This was so good. Me and Ollie, if you're wondering why there's a leaf, me and Ollie had the mint mojito iced coffee, which is one of their specialty iced coffees, and it was so great. I wish it was a bit, this is the biggest size they had, guys. I wish it was more than this. It just made me so happy. <laughs> My last sip. Hello, excuse the weird half-lit face. Lighting the only light I have on in my apartment right now is this lamp next to my bed I am in my bed in my new apartment and I am just so Happy like I had an amazing An amazing like it was a good day. My move took a really long time It took from like 9 a.m. Until I think they were here till 5 p.m. So my move took so long just to move like my stuff. I think the movers did a really great job. They were really nice and they were really efficient as well. So yeah, but other than that, um, it was so good to see Dylan and Ollie. Ollie seriously came over and tonight like he helped me. I didn't, I don't think I filmed since coffee, but Ollie helped me like do so much unpacking, start putting stuff together. He helped me like move my dresser across the whole apartment. I am just, I'm so happy. Like I love my space. I am so excited to like decorate it and get some, you know, new things and place around things that I already have. Squirtle has been so good today. He had such a long day. I'm gonna show you guys him. My camera doesn't want to zoom in, but he is sleeping on the futon right over there, which is so surprising. Um, I'm really happy though because he always, always, always has to sleep in either me or Megan's bed, but he just passed out. I got him. He's on his new doggy blanket. I got him a new doggy blanket and it came in the mail today. It's so soft. So he's just lying on the futon. Um, Squirtle actually doesn't have his own bed anymore because he ate his bed when he had it he never would lie in it and he would just tear all the stuffing out so he has like his crate which is always the door is always open he has a little pad in there he has blankets um but i think he's enjoying the futon spot but i just wanted to say i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog today i'm so excited about my new place um if you guys are wondering about like if you are just coming across this vlog i guess i should have said this at the beginning of the vlog but i did an, a vlog like two weeks ago called answering moving questions if you're like wondering like why i'm not living with megan anymore or, like why i took squirtle or like any of that kind of stuff like i literally addressed everything i'll link that vlog in the description box if you're just like confused or like you're like why why did you move again like i literally answered everything in that vlog so i've been having so much fun like just looking out my window like i have been people watching the whole night like people are just it is like 1 30 a.m and it's just popping also this is me and ollie were getting so much entertainment out of this room because it keeps changing colors they have some crazy thing i don't know if that's someone's like apartment but if it is that's so cool and i want whatever that is if you know what that is leave me a comment down below anyway um this is oh let me just show you i will show you really quick basically what the space is like without my dresser there because i feel like that was just so ugly we also put this like chest right here just for now like literally everything i, I want you guys to like everything i'm showing you is so temporary like i'm actually going to be working with an interior designer friend to like do the space and just everything is like i'm just kind of seeing how things that i already had um looked in the space but i I'm totally probably gonna do some like shifting around but anyway when I get vlogging late at night like this when I'm in bed I just talk for so long and it ends up being like half of the vlog <laughs> this happens so much does it not you guys like the end of my vlog is always so long so I am exhausted I was awake at like 7 a.m. today and it's like 1 something a.m. now so I had like my body is physically sore from moving I guess 
um i am so excited for the sleep i'm about to get and i will see you guys on saturday so excited with my vlogging days recently saturday meg and i will be in san francisco for a macy's meetup which i was supposed to tweet about today and i forgot i just realized yeah we'll be in san francisco and i will see you guys then thank you so much for watching big thumbs up if you enjoyed i love you good night